guys welcome back to my channel welcome to another crazy episode of confession i hope you guys are enjoying the mango madness marathon now listen now i'm moving real fast i pre-recorded two videos already but i had accidentally deleted them already so this confessional video is going to be a little shorter i want to get this video out for you guys tomorrow which is july 20th so this video will be out july 20th before i start make sure you guys like comment and subscribe make sure you guys follow me on instagram tiktok threads what else do i have i don't know if you'd like to submit your own confession the link will be in the description and every single bio of any social platform that i'm on so let's begin when i was six i would eat my mom's hair you see we're already starting on some bullshit when I was six, I used I used my mom's back massage to you know, and I washed it before and after though. Oh, I love to see that you're practicing, you know, cleanliness, but it's never that serious. No, it's never that serious. I have my aunt in a bathroom at the family reunion. I used character AI to do the virtual nasty with the Spider-Man noir because why not pokey? Also, I love your videos. Okay, um, hypothetically speaking, what what app has uh the capabilities of doing the uh said AI to do the virtual nasty in? Hey Mango, my confession is that I go for the cousins and the homeboys, not on purpose. Why? What do you mean you go for the cousins? What you're a groupie? I love being high. This is low-key level one of becoming a cracker. You know that, right? I can't be loyal to just one man. Like, when I do try to be loyal, this ninja shows me why I should keep texting my other you know, I can't, even, I can't even really blame you. I love salt so much, I literally put it on everything. All of my food and my fruit. Sometimes I would lick my foot because it was salty. Ain't no food at home. Oh no, there is food. You're putting salt on everything. You're about to pass out and die. I saw uh, a sex toy outside my house and took it in the house without anyone knowing. And you know, you know, you know, you know. Um, I, I don't, I don't know. You're telling me you, you picked up a toy? What if the toy was laced? What if the toy had fentanyl on it? Now you just put fentanyl in your moochie. Did you think about that? Did you did you wash it? Or you just got right to business? Hmm? Okay. When I was younger, I see my brother's dirty boxers with, you know, stains. I thought it was candy and ate them and wore them. Be so f Be so for real. You thought it was candy? You thought it was candy. When my parents left me alone for a few days to go to a hotel, I found my mom's toy and used it. I used their lube and everything. Wow. You know, usually when teenagers have like the house to themselves, they throw parties, you know, everybody get a little drunk, you know, throw a little house party, but you, you had your own house party in your Bermuda Triangle. Once I was in class and got bricked up and started rubbing my eggplant against the desk and bust. Nice. When I was three years old, I used to lick my dog's hole. And I enjoyed it so much that I bit his nails. And the next day, I got sick with rabies. Oh, wow. And what did we learn? Hmm? What did we learn here, nasty? You nasty. That's what you nasty. Disgusting. I finger pop myself. And before I deliver, I go to a picture of my boyfriend and act like we was playing around. Um, I mean, I can't judge you. I don't do this. I don't relate to this. Before you say things crazy. I don't really. I don't. I don't do it. You know, you you being real, a little bit too real for me. Not saying this is the worst confession I ever heard, but you know, boundaries. I'm getting bullied in school, and someone threatened to fight me because I dropped applesauce, and they said if I hit their shoe, that they they would have beaten my butt. But someone called me fat because I didn't give them my Gatorade at lunch. I'm being myself, and people still bully me. Any tips on how? not to be bullied anymore you need to stand up stand up and when that person was like oh you better not drop apple applesauce on my shoe and if i did and if i did what, what are you gonna do about it what, and if i did what are you gonna do and then the person that called you fat for for not giving you your gatorade i'd be like i'm fat but you you don't got enough money on your on your lunch card and you gotta pay for school lunch and you ask me for for gatorade you don't eat at home and you need to start learning these comebacks quickly and say it fast and when they react don't even look at them just look away as soon as they react be like oh the Walk away. You won. Hey, Mango, I love your video. So when I was eight to nine years old, I discovered corn. And once I put a pencil in my little come de la meow meow, and I didn't take it out. But when I took it out, there was blood on it, and I was so scared, thinking that I got my period. Hope you see this. Love you, Mango. Well, I did see this. Uh, why? No, was it sharpened? I sucked my dog's eggplant because he delivered faster than my boyfriend. Y'all don't need animals no more. 
Y'all don't need no more pets. Give them up for adoption, please. Uh, give them up for adoption, please. Thank you. Hey, Mango, I love your videos. By the way, I bust through the Nair video and I have it downloaded just in case. Yeah, no, you're going to f hell. Why would you send me that? Hey, Mango, my confession is I used to touch the toilet water and play in the toilet when I was three. That's, you see, this is the most wholesome confession. Thank you for that. I needed that reassurance that not everyone in the Mango Mafia is nut, is like that crazy. I needed that. I beat my meat to you once. See, we always lose it. Why do we do this? We we get on track and then we, we, we lose course. Why? Don't do it again. Back in 2021, me and my ex was doing it and I gave him the brain and he milked in one of my eye and now I'm blind line in my right eye when i first got my period i thought it was candy so i did my finger in my pool and it and it and it tastes nasty why does why does everyone think it's candy i need to know what generation is this i do not relate i do not understand who are your parents no actually no i need to talk to the parents that's who i need to talk to because why do you do i think this is cute this is candy my grandma is low-key a and I cannot stand her and even fathom the bull she tries. Anyways, one time she had pissed me off one day, so I stole her meds, pissed in her Listerine bottle, pissed in her soap, and I pissed in, in the toilet at light. I grabbed her electric toothbrush and brushed the bits and skids away. I really don't think I'm in the wrong because she she fondled thousands of dollars from my bank account before I had I had to threaten legal action for rights to the account. Her and her husband beat me until mo multiple of my joints were dislocated over gingerbread cookies years ago. All is well, that ends well. I love your videos, Mango. You truly brighten my day, and even when I watch the new ones, I still want more and rewatch all of them. I generally think that sometimes I wouldn't be where I am because of the fact that your videos can stop me from crying within five seconds. I believe that you are a talented and beautiful person, so please continue creating content and succeeding at life. Love you, Mango. Bye. I mean, thank you. I love the lovely message at the end. But the beginning? My dad pooped and left it in the toilet and I ate it. They got EBT. Y'all don't got food? You know what? Yeah, no. You're done. Mango, I really want to be part of the Mango Mafia, but I have a confession that's really bad. Here I go. One time, I wonder if dogs, females, could deliver. So I took my dogs and finger popped, and all she did was bark and moan, and I smelled my finger and, and felt corny and basically finger popped myself with the same finger. He asked we didn't wash her, my dog, in about a month. Then the next day, my kitty, my kitty pur pure started to burn like a hole in church. And when we went to the doctor, it turns out I got some type of infection and I confessed to my parents and they sold my dog to my neighbors. But anyways, I love you and can I be part of the Mango Mafia? Hashtag, I finger popped my dog and got an infection and my parents sold them to the neighbors. Hashtag slay. You see, your parents did the right thing. Cause why would you I beat my Peter Wacker with my hot, super sexy, gorgeous stepbrother drool? He snores and when I confess, he let me give him brain. And what is that? Is that is that like okay? And we started doing the nasty things mostly during parties. Then when my dad split with my mom, we confessed that we were a thing and now we're engaged in planning our wedding from a nasty drool beating meat lover. Mwah. One time I had a clay for pottery and I shaped it in an eggplant and put plastic in it and used it as a toy. How lovely, how lovely. I love how everybody's so creative. Number one, y'all nasty, seek help. Number two, love you, Mango. Anyways, I still haven't got my period yet and I'm 11, should I be concerned? No, you shouldn't be concerned. Um, I mean, a lot of people get get them like really early. I got mine pretty early and like I was like nine, you know, it's kind of early. So it's, it's not it's not too bad, it's not too bad. People get it at 18, people get it at 23, it's okay, it's okay. My man got a green eggplant and for some reason, every time he puts it in, I start to feel very tingled. And after it starts to burn, and it glows. Who are you messing with? The Green Lantern? Are you single? I'm obsessed with you. I am single. I use a mascara too to pleasure myself. Hi Mango, you remind me of my older sister for some reason. I don't get to see her a lot, so your content brings me comfort except for all those very disturbing confessions. Y'all need to get y'all together. 
Anyways, I love you, Mango. I love you too, baby. I shoved a whole pool noodle up my moon cheek. It felt so good. Anyways, love you, Mango. Now, there's different types of pool noodles. No matter how long it is, they all are pretty thick. So, if your moon cheek this size, I put Windex in my grandma Kool-Aid, but I poured it out because I felt bad and thought she was going to die. She would have. And guess where you would have went? <laughs> to hell. When I was younger, I used to go under my parents' bed. And when I was home alone, so one day, my parents came back home. I was finna surprise them. But then they got on the bed and my mom was making weird noises and I heard clapping. Never went under their bed again. When I was born, the doctor broke my arm so it is stuck in a specific position. My mother sued him and I get checks and a big check on my birthday and my dad wanted the money for her spend since he was my father but my mom said no, it's going to be safe for the future for college. And that's how the bad relationship started. All I am to him is a walking dollar sign. I'm so sorry that you're going through this. You're definitely blessed. You're still alive. You are definitely blessed. And you know, look at that man. I know he's your father, but girl, we gonna, we gotta we gotta, we gotta cut them off somehow. Even even family could be toxic. I let my cousin play with my kitty. Me and my sister dipped my special needs uncle's br toothbrush in the toilet and watched him use it, not knowing it was his. But anyways, love you, Mango. You know God saw you, right? You you know the man above you saw you? Okay, I'm just making sure you, you know he saw you, right? My grandma comes in my room at night and licks my dog's coochie. <laughs> Does she have dementia? Um, this autistic girl snitched on me for eating in class. So when I seen her in the hallway, I tripped her down the steps. You know, God gonna see you right. I, I feel like y'all forgetting that the man above sees all. Hey, Mango. So this isn't a confession. It's, this is more like a suggestion. You should start doing a series where you apply your wigs and makeup. Um, you see, I wouldn't mind because you know, see, that'll probably be a lot easier for me to edit too because I do it all the time. But you guys don't watch it. You guys lie to me every single time. That's tell me, oh my God, Mango, I want vlogs. I post a vlog. I go ghost. My grandma spit in my drink, so I pushed it into the glass table, and she and she rushed to the hospital. Okay, trauma. One time I drank my pee because I wanted to know what it tastes like. And, and, and what did you gain from that? I mango. I saw you at Walmart, and you was looking so juicy. I delivered in my pants, and I don't I don't know if you saw me, but this was a while back. Love you, jail. This is not a confession, but my ex owes me like 5k, and I've been telling him to pay me back, and I haven't been on top of that, and he blocked me. Should I sue him? Sue, sue that mother okay so when i was like eight i pretended to have sex with my stuffed animals you see i'm starting to see this a lot is this like a trend i used to lick my cousin's toes and they tasted so good so i ate the dirt from under his toenails Am I just everybody's diary? Like, it, it's like the dirt underneath their toenail. They did dirt. Oh. One time I was bored, so I pooped in a cup and let my dog eat it. Mm -mm. They need to take your pet away from you. I may go love your confession videos, but my confession is that my TikTok FYP is full of videos smashing their bloody tampons on an anime poster. Is there any advice on how I can change this? What do you search up? You know, these only pop up when you like them, right, baby? That's what you like. Don't be surprised. Don't be shocked. I love you, Mango, and sorry for these crazy videos. What are your thoughts on chicken nuggets? I'm, I'm not a big fan of chicken nuggets. I mean, they're cool, but like, I'm more of a chicken tender. I use my granddad diapers because I didn't have any more pads. Love you, Mango. Okay. Every time I go outside, I like to put bird seeds in my moochie and let the birds eat it until I crib. Oh, no. You're going to get an infection. There's one time when I had my pad in my, okay, and it kept falling out, so I glued I glued the top and the bottom, and then it got stuck on my cooch, and I couldn't get it off, so I used Dawn dish soap, and now I got an infection. Nice. Okay, that's it for today's confession videos. Thank you guys for watching. I know this is shorter than the last couple ones because they were like 30 minutes, but your girl gotta do what she gotta do. Thank you guys for watching today's video. We're on the road to 50K subscribers. Like, I don't think I understand. Like, we are so close to 50K, and we are so close to 100K. Um, but thank you guys for watching. Mingo loved you. I will always love you and shine on, baby, because you are bright. Love you. Everybody Shake, 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 shake,